Hi guys, you are watching Ask and Jeevi Teje and I am an empire. So finally I am back with a video after two weeks. So let me tell you that I had J Advanced 2019 to write and it was a bit difficult for me. I don't know how it was for you. So comment down below if you wrote J Advanced 2019. How was it? Which were the difficult subjects? Which were the easy ones? For me, I guess chemistry was an easy one. So let's come to the point. Today's video is about should I repeat one year or should I drop one year for JEE advanced or should I drop one year for IIT? So this is a great question that comes to all the JEE aspirants by the end of their JEE preparation. Like by the end of the JEE preparation when, we're, when they reach to somewhat February or March, a person will know whether he will get an NIT, at least an NIT or an IIT. The moment he realizes that he may not get NIT or IIT, his mind suddenly shifts to repeating one year or as in North India it says dropping one year. So why they are saying like that? Because we have a general feel that we are not being able to crack NIT or IIT just because we are not getting enough time that we are almost for the two years we are take of two years we are in school we are spending most of the time there and that we are not getting enough time to study these things but either this feeling may be true for some students who have great potential but in my case it was like there was time i couldn't use it efficiently i used it but i am saying that most of the students are not utilizing the time efficiently so what you should do if you have a question inside you that should I repeat or not, stay around for one hour or two hours. Think deeply. The things you should think about is that the thought of repeating has come just now. It may motivate you to study for one year, just for two months or three months. Maybe it may long for six months. Like I have seen a lot of my seniors saying that they have stopped repeating one year by the end of December and they are staying in the home doing nothing. So this is a great decision of taking one year back. Like you will have to, you should be committed, 100% committed that I will stick to this goal till the March 2020 if I am repeating in 2019. So why I am saying this that you should be pretty clear about what all the difficulties you will suffer. If you are going to somewhere like Kota and all, and if you are staying somewhere else and studying, for example, Brilliant Pala in Kerala, a lot of students from Kerala go to there and do repeat for one year and they study. But in most of the cases, what happens is that they lose the mind, they lose the confidence by then because the training out there is a lot intensive. There is quality of education, but it's a lot intensive that, that they compel you to study a lot of things, especially because J. Advanced asks a lot of things out of the book. So that's a major thing you should understand before taking the decision of repeat. And if not repeat, then what? I will suggest you to join a good local engineering college. Like in Kerala, there are many good colleges like CET, Model Engineering Ernaulam, and etc. etc. So what you should do is, you should first check or uh, investigate whether there is a good college in your area or in neighboring state which has good quality of education. If there is such one, go and join. Otherwise, you can repeat. Repeat is a good option, but I will repeat that you should be committed, pretty committed that you will clear JE in the next year. So that's it guys. I hope our journey of 12th is pretty much over along with me. I have completed my 12th. So I want to tell that all those who have completed their 12th may be thinking, should I Keep watching videos of this channel because the videos coming in the next year will also be related to JEE. So your 12th is over. So then why should you watch this video? If such a thought is coming to you, don't unsubscribe the channel. I will bring you more videos about lifestyle, college, admissions and a lot of things that will be useful for the people of my age that is of 18. And also. I will bring JE videos also, not the same videos that I will repeat from the last year. I will bring something great, something different, some thoughtful videos, some advices as I have passed 12th.
so what you should do what how you should help me is that recommend this channel to two or three of your juniors in school colleges or your sisters brothers everybody who you know so that we can grow this family if we grow i can bring lot of new stuff i can monetize this channel so i repeat don't unsubscribe instead recommend others to subscribe that's it guys thanks for watching if you are seeing this channel for the first time click the subscribe button and there are a lot of videos regarding je and kim so that's it guys bye